on Thursday the 23rd. Uh, now, <laughs> this is what winds me up. Um, South Africa has been saying long this is a mild case Omicron, which, yeah, I've been saying as well, you know, it's been a mild case. Okay, the government realised and they're saying that it's still a threat to NHS, which it is, because people will still be going to hospital but not dying, so the hospital beds will be. So I can understand that point of view. But they did say that, don't keep saying it's only mild a few days ago, but now they're saying it's mild. I can understand because it's still a new thing and they're learning about it and stuff like that. But um, yeah, the, restriction, the restrictions could still take effect, but be only for a few weeks, hopefully. So I did film um, the Matrix Regenerations review, which I'll add to this. I've just seen The Matrix uh, <laughs> Resurrections and wow, um, what can I say about it? It's not the best film in the world. I mean, Spider Man No Way Home is better, but The Matrix, the way they did it, the way they've done the film is mad amazing confusing just as the original film confused you with the story and twists this confuses you still but it does answer a few things and it explains why the same characters are different people blah 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 and I love the way that Keanu Reeves character uh, Mr. Anderson has been drawn back into the Matrix world and this story of how it happened and how he managed to survive and how Trinity managed to survive. I love that interaction, that kind of story because it's more easily explained than most Matrix films. A <laughs> um, few bits in it that were a bit, I'm not going to spoil it, a few bits in it that were a bit long-winded thinking, okay, carry on skip the next bit, no, skip to the important bits. You knew what was coming up sometimes. First off, the film was just like, wow. I love the way they interacted the first movie, like the first few movies into the film and film footage from the movies, how they did it and why they did it. It was fantastic, brilliant. Um, I mean, you see films with lots of nostalgic bits, but this does it in a way that's like, oh, Bloody hell, wow. <laughs> you know, there's lots of wow factors, but there's lots of bits that drag on a bit. <laughs> but I love the film in a way that it's like, you go for it, you go, 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 go. It's like, wow, the ending is like powerful. It's like, yes, the ending that you want. I'm not spoiling it, <laughs> but it's the ending that you want and it's a good ending. And I hope they can do another one because it would be good to see another one. Um, some of the effects were a bit, a bit, um, looked a bit cheapish, but they weren't. Some of the fight scenes you could see were a bit choreographed. Uh, yeah. Overall, like about 7 out of 10. So, as I said, this will be added in to Thursday's vlog. Um, if I can't find anything else to talk about, <laughs> of course, they say they've got the quiz and stuff, so yeah, so there you go. Watch it if you're a Matrix fan, watch it. Another thing I forgot to add as well if you're a YouTuber, um, content creator, whatever you call yourselves these days, um, do you ever have them days when you're thinking, oh, I got nothing to record, I don't know what I'm going to record? I don't know what I'm going to do, talk about. Uh, I had that, I started thinking, what am I going to do Thursday? Because, you know, it's going to be a shorter day for me because I've got the quiz and stuff. But as soon as you get the camera or phone out to start talking, it just comes naturally. It just, <laughs> you know, it's very rare I plan. Um, I plan my videos like Radio Times or Top 10 Films or that kind of stuff. But when it comes to on the camera and doing these kind of chats I don't plan them 
unless I've got something important to say. I do bullet points. So I don't know, do you have the same kind of thing? You know, um, I don't know, just put, I'll put it out there, see if I'm not the only one or it happens to everyone. I don't know. It's more like it. Okay, so it's now 4.30, finished work early so we could do, so we can get ready for the quiz. Um, this makes it look a bit yellow, I'm not yellow, trust me. Uh, that's a bit, a bit better, oh, it's a bit yellow, um, yeah, so anyway, uh, yeah, let's finish early, so in half an hour's time we've got to go back and do the quiz. Um, fun Christmas quiz. Uh, yeah, <laughs> don't know what team I'm going to be in, I don't know who I'm going to be put with. Uh, so, the quiz is over, and it's very entertaining, shall I say. Um, there was three teams of four, and our team was last, but we had a damn good laugh. It was all really Christmas related or 2021 related, and uh, yeah, it was good fun. <laughs> anyway, um. I'm going to leave you to it and I shall speak to you tomorrow. For tomorrow it's going to be Christmas Eve. Um, so yeah, <sighs> just relax now. It's now ten past seven. Uh, relax. Just, yeah. And I'll catch you tomorrow. Thank you for watching. If you watch this far, subscribe, like, comment, blah, blah, blah. See you tomorrow.